Good evening. I'm Reverend Valerie K. Gunch, and I would like to share our meditation for this evening, which is on freedom. It's the eve of our American Independence Day. And in our world and in our country right now, there's a lot of turmoil. Perhaps you too have been affected by certain news and decisions that have been made in our country regarding our external freedoms. Our daily word happens to talk about freedom and the affirmation they gave for tomorrow is, I am grateful to be free in God. So we may wish to have relief from our burdens or freedom from our limitations and you may feel frustrated and disappointed about a number of things, whatever it is, because we all do go through frustration and disappointment more than once, more than twice throughout our lives. So now the time is to practice, to use our practice of going within, to turn to prayer for spiritual understanding. Now, our daily word is celebrating its centennial this month, July 1st, 1923. It is as true today as it was then that God in me is my light and understanding. God in me is my light and understanding. It's so important that we remember that. And that scripture in Proverbs that says, turn to the Lord your God and lean not to your own understanding. So we continue in this meditation to remember and affirm, God in me is my light and understanding. And, and to affirm, in God I am free, and at the level of spirit, nothing can bind me, nothing binds me. From a place of wholeness, I can respond to outer circumstances and remain sovereign in my life. From a place of wholeness, I can respond to outer circumstances and remain sovereign in my life. And this last idea from that Daily Word message for tomorrow, as I loosen the tight grip of my worldly situations, I claim my spiritual freedom. So I'd like to take these ideas into meditation this evening. And I do want to say uh, a quote from the Daily World. It says, and when we do this, my worldly situations may not have changed, but I have. And from this place of empowerment, I am eternally free, unquote, from the Daily Word. So let us prepare for meditation now by partaking of a song from Denise Rosier called I Am.
So now, continue with these ideas of I am. I am as God created me. I am love created by love and for love. And so as we relax and breathe and continue to let go in our meditation time, to release our hold on those stressful thoughts and ideas, that the mass consciousness has in our collective. As I loosen my agreement with those ideas and thoughts, I claim my spiritual freedom. And as I go within and as I return and come from my wholeness, then that light of understanding guides me on what is mine to do. So as we go into the meditation and the, you are supported by the sounds of the music, ask yourself this question. Who have I come here to be? Who have I come here to be? I am free to be who I came here to be. I am as God created me. I am as God created me. I am here to be peace, to be love. I am here to be free.
And as we come to the last idea in this meditation, I am sovereign over the tyrannical thoughts of my mind. The I am of me is sovereign over the tyrannical thoughts of fear, desperation, limitation in my mind. I choose peace. I allow nothing to disturb my peace. And lastly, as I loosen the tight grip of my worldly situations, I claim my spiritual freedom. And so it is. Have a blessed week. Thank you for joining us, and namaste.